China's top nuclear envoy has reiterated Beijing's strong opposition to the planned deployment to the Korean Peninsula of a powerful U.S. missile defense system known as THAAD. The latest confirmation came during meetings with South Korean officials in Seoul on Monday. Kwon Soa reports. Another straightforward confirmation. China's special representative to the six-party nuclear talks, Wu Dawei, has reaffirmed Beijing's opposition towards the possible deployment of a U.S. THAAD missile defense system to South Korea. This latest confirmation came after a closed-door meeting with Seoul's Foreign Minister Yoon byung se on Monday. China is opposed to the U.S. and South Korea stance on the deployment of THAAD in South Korea. We explain China's stance and hope that the U.S. and South Korea give weight to China's interests and that they handle this issue appropriately. According to an official at Seoul's foreign ministry, the issue was also addressed during a separate meeting between Wu and Vice Foreign Minister Im Song nam earlier in the day. The official said, though, the two spent a majority of their time on other issues of mutual interest, and the Chinese envoy used the meeting to emphasize the importance of Seoul and Beijing's strategic cooperative partnership. Seoul's foreign ministry stated that Wu and Foreign Minister Yun assessed the unprecedented strong UN Security Council sanctions against North Korea, which were formed through some 50 days of close cooperation, would be adopted soon. It also said that China vowed sincere efforts towards an effective implementation of the sanctions. China's top nuclear envoy is expected to continue discussions with South Korean officials, including Unification Minister Hong Yong-pyo on Tuesday, before returning to China on Thursday. Kwon Soa, Arirang News.